Hi everybody, Mopsy here again. Uh, this is going to be a really short one on how to um, use characters from the character map. And by that I mean the character map um, that's on your standard computers where you can put in the different symbols like your, co Sorry. <laughs> your copyright or your registered trademark. And if I come down here you've got Greek in there somewhere you've got Hebrew, Latin uh, and French various characters if you're doing something like um, birth weight um, birth stats um, you've got half there so half inch three quarter of an inch if you wanted to do it so that's your character map and every character is assigned a key on the keyboard um, for this demonstration, I'm going to use the R for the registered trademark because someone has asked me for that. And if you look down here, it's telling me that the keystroke is the, the Alt key plus 0174. And that's 0174 on your numbers lock, your numbers pad on your keyboard. You can't do it with the numbers along the top of your keyboard. But I'll, I'll come to that in a moment. So I'm going to open a new hoop. I'm going to go to my TTF, my true type fonts, next, type in the box. Now I'm holding down my Alt key and on my uh, nums pad I'm going 0174. Now I'm releasing my Alt key and the moment I release it, you can see here I've got the R for the registered character. Um, this is in Arial, but there's a lot of um, fonts that will... Um, allow you to use the character map there will be some that you can't um, but for the, just for the, for this I'm just going to come up and do the aerial so I'm going to say OK to that next I'm going to do column stitch and finish and there it is on the on the screen if I come up here um, to my magnifying glass and zoom in a little bit and say stitch it there's your registered trademark and of course it holds in the last thing that you did and as you can see on here I've got a satin outline I don't want that satin outline so I'm going to select it again come up here to my outline edit design embroidery settings and just turn off that satin outline apply that come to the outside ring, turn off the satin outline and apply that, um, close my box, stitch it, come out and let's view realistic view. And so there we have the registered trademark, um, but that could have been any of the characters on the character map and I don't know if this is going to work. I did try to do something here to help show you. What I'm talking about is using your Alt key down here, or you could use this one, it doesn't matter, they're identical. And then you have to use the numbers over on your numbers pad. You can't use the numbers across the top. Um, and that. So you can't use these ones. You have to use the numbers on the numbers pad. And it's a simple a case of just pressing and holding the alt key down and keeping this one held down and then on your nums pad in this case 0174 and then release the alt um, key and let me minimize that so that will give you your registered trademark in this case um, go back to the character map let's say you wanted to do the copyright symbol in this case it hold down your alt key and then press 0169 and release let's say you wanted to write something in French and you wanted um, oh, I've forgotten what that's called above the <laughs> above the E um, the accent above above the E that would be alt 0201 on the keypad um, the English pound, alt 0163, um, the at symbol, 
um, is not something that we can do in Arial because it hasn't given me the the code set that I need for that. Um, so as I said, there are some things that you can do. It might be in a different font. that it will allow me um, but let's go down and let's say birth stats and you wanted a half hold down your alt key and zero one eight nine so I'm gonna come out of that go back into TTF hold down my alt key um, 0189 there's the half select the font Arial next again column stitch and finish and there we have the half and again because I didn't save this yet it's it's held in with my satin outline which is a pain so Come to embroidering settings, setting outline, apply. Turn off the setting outline, apply. Oh, oh. Turn off the setting outline and apply. Stitch it, close, come out of that. So there we have the half symbol and registered trademark. So I hope that's helped. Um, I know this was a, a, a quick video, but um, I hope somebody gets something out of it anyway. Um, take care, everybody, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.